uh, just in the briefest of introductions with respect to this song, as a longtime baseball fan, I would always enjoy the cigarettes and beer commercials. Now you know cigarette commercials are verboten. Instead, what they're showing is couples sitting in adjacent bathtubs. I saw this, and the thing that inspired me to write the song was something that actually says, call your doctor if erections last more than four hours, and I figured that was a clarion call to all of us. In a lifetime spent courting the ladies with performances free of compunction, till along came a curse straight from Hades in the form of erectile dysfunction. If of late I've appeared somewhat downcast, tis a consequence sadly of aging. As I pine for virility long past, came an ad I found frankly engaging. Now I'm a new guy, Viagra. You're worth more than my stock in Conagra. What once dripped from the tip of my withering dagger cascades like the falls of Niagara. Next came a commercial which promised a potency worthy of warning. Every late middle age doubting Thomas that it might keep him up until morning. What I've learned from V. Levitra, his experience is the best teacher. In the past, the short subject was clearly my limit. Now I last for the whole double feature. In the end came a pill whose vast powers cautioned its prospective triers. Call your doc if erections last more than four hours. Whew. So I joined the stampede of new buyers. You're my lucky star, see Alice. You're my aurora borealis. I get plaudits divine from my consorts of mine who give thanks to you, as does my phallus. So who cares if the whites of your eyes have turned blue? Big deal if your vision is blurred. Boo, 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 boo. So what if your chest pounds and you ache like the flu? If your auger is stern, look at what you can do. You can walk around the house drawing clothes on your thing. It's enough to make any man stand up and sing as you dream up new ways to surprise her. Save some praise for the Countess at Pfizer. Well, thank you so much. That was just hysterical. It was really funny. And if you want to find John, go to www.folklawproductions.com.